The good news of salvation. Ephesians 1 and verse 13. In, you, in him you also trusted after you heard the word of truth, the gospel of your salvation, in whom also, having believed, you were sealed with the Holy Spirit of promise. In talking about the good news in the New Testament, the Apostle Paul points us to the fact that this good news of Jesus Christ is really the good news of our salvation. The word salvation is a really interesting word in the New Testament. Uh, one of the most common Greek words uh, used for salvation is sozo. And that word sozo is a comprehensive word. You know, many times when we talk about salvation, uh, we think only about uh, forgiveness of sins. We think about salvation in the terms of having our sins forgiven. But really in the New Testament and in the Greek understanding of that word sozo, which is God bringing deliverance, God bringing victory, God bringing forgiveness, God bringing healing, God bringing freedom, God bringing liberty or liberation, total wholeness into our person. And so that is what we need to embrace, that Christ coming into the world meant salvation, a total wholeness for me. That when I come to Jesus Christ, He doesn't just say, look, I'll forgive you your sins, but you know, the rest of your life, you just got to figure out yourself and then I'll just hope you make it across the finish line and I'll pick you up into heaven. That's not it. Christ coming into this world is good news of salvation. It's the good news of wholeness coming into our lives through what He did for us on the cross. I want you to thank God that Christ coming into this world means so so to you, that you can receive total wholeness in your life. Thank Him that that's what's been made available to you and thank Him that that's what you want to receive. You want to have in your life the complete package of salvation, the good news of salvation for you and me. Let's pray. Father, we thank you for the gospel of salvation, for the gospel that brings total wholeness into our lives because Jesus Christ came to save us. I pray that we will experience the full salvation that Jesus Christ came to bring to, our, to us in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.